Now to the growing scandal at the Department of Veterans Affairs. Outrage over delays in life-saving care. This weekend, President Obama is demanding answers. ABC's Jim Avila has the latest. The White House scrambling to contain a spreading scandal at the VA, sending a Mr. Fix-It, Deputy Chief of Staff Rob Neighbors, to the Phoenix VA, where it all began. The president calling his Veterans Affairs Secretary to the Oval Office and promising veterans anyone cooking the books to hide long delays to see a VA doctor will be punished. I want every veteran to know we are going to fix whatever is wrong. I'm going to keep on fighting to deliver the care and the benefits and the opportunities that your families deserve. It's a scandal that has traction across political parties and TV channels. A real scandal, Jimmy Trump! Whistleblowers coming forward to expose secret lists that hid long waits to see a doctor. People actually died because of the delay. Because of the delay in getting care. Troy Burmish was a scheduler in Phoenix, ordered by hospital supervisors, he says, to hide the real wait times, months long, on handwritten, untraceable lists. The bosses in Washington couldn't yeah. tell. Couldn't yeah, tell. no, there's no way. They were looking at a computer screen which told them what? Less than two weeks, which is not even close. Veterans like Thomas Breen dying of painful cancer while waiting nearly a year to see a doctor. He was delayed care completely and on that secret list because I have proof. VA Secretary General Eric Shinseki ending the week visiting Capitol Hill to say he won't quit despite a wave of calls for him to resign, finally issuing this statement saying, the scandal is of great personal concern to me, and if true, we will act. For this week, Jim Avila, ABC News, Phoenix. We'll talk more about that on the roundtable.